Joyce is getting too close. This is too close, and I planned it so well. I'm stupid. I'm just stupid. Ah! And then, besides finding all that, I spotted this card and picked it up on my way out. Beacon House, Anchorage, Alaska? Yeah, I gotta get up there and check it out. So Dominic has a girlfriend? He never, ever said a word about her. Joey, I didn't... Oh. No, that's okay. Hi, Miss Perkins. Uh, Kelly, it's nice to see you again. You two talk for a minute. I want to go make a few phone calls and check some things out. Uh, may I get you anything? No, or... thanks. I'm fine. Please, sit down. Thank you. Uh, Miss Perkins, I know it must seem strange seeing me again. Looking very well. Thank you. Look, I, I just want you to know that I've finally come to believe Joe's innocent. I'm glad. Look, I've talked to someone who backs up Joe's alibi. I owe you an apology, too. Well, Kelly, I, I do appreciate that. There are not too many people in this town who could admit to being wrong, especially since you were the one who testified against him. Look, I, I, I really hate to say this, Kelly, but if it weren't for what you said at the trial, Joe probably wouldn't have gone to prison. No, I know. It was a terrible thing I did. But at the time, I honestly believed Joe was guilty. Now I know the truth. You know, when you make a mistake like that, it's hard to live with yourself. I'm sure this must mean a great deal to Joe. Above all, I think the thing he wanted most was for you to believe in him. I just hope you can all forgive me. I can. Kelly, thank you. I just wish Joe's father could be as open-minded. Yeah. I'm sure it won't be long before Joe can prove he's innocent to everyone. I hope so. Hey, I called information in Anchorage about that Beacon House. And? It's an institute for the emotionally disturbed. I've got to go up there. I've got to find the connection. 